guys welcome to my channel if you're new or if you are returning to my channel then welcome back so today's video is going to be all about self-care i am all about self-care i love having a good pamper having time to myself and making sure i take time to like really invest in good skincare routine and all that kind of stuff so this video is in collaboration with tjc so this video is kindly sponsored by tjc i've worked with tjc before i've worked with them during christmas a few weeks ago for mother's day i love working with tjc and i'm so glad that they have worked with me today and sponsored this video so i have some things from tjc they actually do beauty and things on their website in case that you didn't know so they have a whole range of skincare makeup all that sorts of stuff so i have a few bits that i'm going to show you guys and some bits that i've been using so one thing i've been loving doing at the moment is wearing self-tan so i've been wearing like a gradual tan just to make me feel a bit more like you know a bit more me and a bit you know bronzed so i've been using a gradual tanner so i do like to scrub my body before i do any self tan so on tjc they sell bondi sands they sell tan on there so i wanted to try the coconut and sea salt body scrub which is this is by bondi sands the australian tan company so i got their exfoliate so this is obviously perfect to use before you tan you don't have to use it before you tan you can just use it anyway in the shower because it's really nice to always exfoliate your body and get rid of all impurities of your skin so this is a coconut and sea salt body scrub it's you just apply it to damp skin and massage it and obviously you use it one to two times a week. Oh, so Bondi Sands Body Scrub has been carefully formulated to be self-tan friendly. So it's oil free, enhanced with gen gentle cleansers to effortlessly wash away residue, leave skin soft, clean and ready for your self-tan application. So I'm gonna be using this, I'm gonna use this, I'm gonna have a bath, I'm gonna soak, I'm gonna scrub myself, and then I'm probably gonna pop on some fake tan because it just makes you feel nice when you're a bit more, you know, bronzed and stuff. And I do like to fake tan, not always. And during lockdown, I've been loving just using like a gradual self tanner. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use this. You can't go wrong with a nice body scrub because it's just a perfect self-care item, I think. I think we forget about our bodies. Like we always put like skincare on our face but we forget about our bodies to exfoliate our bodies and moisturize our bodies and things so when i was choosing some of the things on the website they sell lots of different brands that i've never really heard of before obviously they sell bondi sands brands that we will have heard of before but these are sorts of brands that i've never heard of before so we have a brand called original skin energy and a brand called skin chemists london so i've never heard of this brand these brands before i saw these and they looked really really interesting i'm 30 next year and now more than ever i want to obviously take care of my skin a lot more i'm getting wrinkles like I get wrinkles under my eyes so much so i've got some products that hopefully will help so i have the original skin energy collagen 100 so this has got collagen in there and um, let me open it it's got one of those little sticky seals so yeah i've never heard this brand before this is anti-aging serum infused with marine collagen peptides and hyaluronic acid which is a amazing hyaluronic acid is perfect i love using that in my skincare routine it's perfect for dry skin and things like that so it's a cute little bottle it's purple it's the right decent size so it looks really really nice so yeah does it smell nice i'm gonna smell it in a second so the hyaluronic acid is to improve elasticity and fine wrinkles so you apply three to four drops to tone face skin so obviously use this after you've cleansed and stuff but i'm gonna have a little smell see if it smells anything oh yeah you can do i it's funny i can i've used hyaluronic acid product before and you can definitely really smell the ingredients so i don't like serums that are quite thick and heavy like so this is a really nice light serum i don't know if you can see that there So I would use this after I've cleansed. I do two cleanses and then I'll put on a serum and then I'll go in with an eye cream and then a moisturiser. I saw this, guys, and I just... I, do you know what sold it to me? It says the word wrinkle killer. So 
I might, yeah, I want to kill my wrinkles. So this is by a brand called Skin Chemists London. Again, a brand I've never heard of before. Things, so yeah, I really like to look at this. So this is the Advanced Wrinkle Killer Dual Moisturiser. It's firm, smooth, protects. It's for all skin types. So that's what it looks like. That's the box. That's the packaging. Wrinkle Killer. I mean, who doesn't want that? It's got sign. I write, I don't know how you pronounce these because they're all like sciencey chemically like names but it's got Synac, Synac I think aims to reduce the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles we've got Aqua, Aqualix, Aqualix is the hyaluronic acid booster which helps to deeply hydrate the skin which is what I need I always use hyaluronic acid now it's just something that I always incorporate into my skincare routine because it's just amazing and if you don't use the hyaluronic acid and you've never used it before I definitely recommend it because especially if you've got really dry skin and your skin needs lots of hydration I use it all the time and I just smother myself and stuff and it's just my skin's just so good so and it also has Grancil D D um, CM5 which is a mattifying agent and facial oil absorber aiming to leave a matte smooth and non oily finished amazing so it's quite a big product 50 mils i like the packaging oh i'm getting my lipstick stuck to my lips my hair so oh really nice light moisturizer guys it's not thick or anything like that so i think a little will go a long way but it oh it smells kind of like what's the ingredients in there oh i don't know oh it's got coconut oh can i smell coconut a little bit smells really really nice so it's a uk brand it's made in the uk guys so wrinkle killer i'm gonna be using this like so much but like oh my god let me just rub that in a bit more Sometimes when you use products and you can see the difference on your hands, like my wrinkles gone yet. Definitely looks a lot smoother. So yeah, wrinkle killer, moisturizer, and then lips, right guys? I think lips are neglected. I saw this on the website and this is by a brand called is it Setum? Setum London, sp spelled C E T. I don't know. So this is the S C R Gold Lip Allure. So this is a lip product. Use it morning and night. I get such dry lips. And one thing that I've been doing recently is when I'm doing my makeup, I'll put my moisturizer on, and then I put a lip balm or whatever on my lips, and leave that to like obviously soak before I'm putting like product on my lips. So this looked really interesting it smells good and it's a it's like a balm it's like just obviously i'm not gonna put on my lips i've got lipstick on but yeah it's really really nice so it just smells really nice like definitely worth investing in a good lip product because our lips my lips are always dry so so dry and I love the look of this so it's a really nice really nice little color balm lip balm so you definitely lip products and lip balms are perfect so you may be thinking self-care is all about just you know having a pamper things like that but doing your skincare routine that sort of thing but I feel like for me self-care is all about things that you enjoy doing so anything that you enjoy doing whether that's sitting down reading a book or you know getting into bed listen to a bit of music i feel like that's really nice self-care just sitting down chilling popping some headphones on and just listening to a bit of music and zoning out and just you know having a nice time one thing that i love to do for my for, for a bit of my self-care is to like if i'm feeling a bit on the downside and i just want to cheer myself up obviously a nice skincare do my skincare but wearing makeup is something that i really love to do and it really does lift my mood you know I, i'd class it as self-care for me because it's you know something i'm doing for myself and it makes me feel good and i enjoy it so 
TJC Cell Makeup and I picked up the Bourjois Paris Rouge Edition Velvet Lipstick Collection. So this is a liquid lipstick collection. So you get five in there. They're all matte liquid lipsticks and these just look gorgeous like I love lipstick. Lipstick, I could I don't think I could ever wear my makeup without wearing a lipstick or even just like a bit of a gloss, but I have to have I've just always been obsessed with lipsticks and it's just something that I always like to wear. So, <clears throat> we have some gorgeous, gorgeous colours. How nice is that? We have a Honey Mood Ultraviolet. This is called Pink Pong. <laughs> a nice bright pink colour. And then, like a really nice berry and brown colour, which are called Chocolate Corset and Berry Chic. So yeah, makeup, you know? It's, it's a really nice thing to wear. It definitely makes me feel good. I love wearing it and it really lifts my mood when I do wear makeup. So that's the end of the video. There are all my little tips, things that I just like to do for my self-care and things what help me, make me feel good. I would love to know what you guys do for your self-care, what makes you feel good, things that you do and you know things that you have in your self-care routine i would love to know so leave some comments down below and let me guys know what you love to do for your self-care routine is there anything in particular you know sometimes i just like to just sit down and listen to some music or read a book or eat some chocolate you know self-care doesn't have to just be about pampering yourself and having a bath it could be anything you want it to be something that you enjoy that makes you feel good and you just you know take time for yourself and just have a little bit of self-care but i hope that you did enjoy this video guys if you did make sure that you give it a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already but thank you so so much for watching guys and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys